Okay. All right, hey, once again, Chris Fuller here for B Atlanta, doing an interview at 40 Hells here. Um, how, what, what kind of music would you guys find yourself as? Oh, jeez. Um, punk rock. Straight up punk rock? That's, all, yeah, well, that's, all, that's what I would do, too. Yeah. If anybody has anything else to add, then. Indie, indie, yeah. indie punk rock. Indie yeah. punk rock. Yeah. Yeah. So You've got some ex external influences. Mm -hmm. yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Well, I used to be in a punk band, um, and I used to like love, you know, um, Rancid, No Effects, and all the, all those, all the punk bands. You know what I mean? So um, when I saw you guys tonight, tonight with the vinyl, um, I was just like, hell yeah! Like I haven't seen a band that's been playing like just straight up punk rock. You know, just like straight up soulful punk rock, and I haven't seen that in years. Yeah. So honestly, congrats to you guys. You did. You were awesome. Thank you. We're you were awesome on stage. Yeah. And just thought you were a great, great band. Thanks so very much. We just kind of want to hear um, a little bit about you guys. And you know, like where'd you come from? Are you guys all from Atlanta? Well, uh, most of us are from Atlanta. Uh, Joel is from Fort Walton Beach. We've all been doing bands for years and years and years. Um, but this seems to be the one that really we all are enjoying the most. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So traveling really well with the group. Yeah. Good. Yeah. I, I mean, honestly, like. Um, I notice your drumming. Like uh, a lot of punk drumming is, you know, it's mediocre. I mean, just because you know they probably don't know how to play drums that well. But, but honestly, I thought as far as punk drums go, like that was top notch, man. Well, thank Definitely. you very much. What well, What is your name? Can you guys just introduce yourselves and the instruments you play? My name is Joel Purdue, and I play drums. Yeah, I'm uh, Neil Feltz. I'm a resident bass player at the moment. I'm Shane Secor, I'm the uh, guitar player, vocalist. We all sing, also. <clears throat> yeah. I noticed that when y'all were playing that you all sang, and I think that's really cool. And I just, I also, you know, as far as a three-person band goes, it's either, you know, um, sink or swim, kind of. Yeah. But you guys pretty definitely pretty. are swimming, and, and, it, and that kind of diverted me from the point that I was going for, which is that you guys seem to be really together on stage. That's like something we're shooting for, definitely. Yeah. You guys were very, very like, you know, cool, cool on stage and you got a very good stage presence, especially when you're Thank singing, you. man. It's very it's very uh, epic. Yeah. Singing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, it means yeah. a lot that uh, that we're reaching people, you know. It's uh, Yeah. I'm glad you know. That seems to be something people are enjoying a lot is that we all three sing and that we can harmonize, you know. Yeah. That's, okay. That's definitely, <laughs> definitely I think added a new uh, sort of dimension the sound that was maybe lacking in the past. Yeah, I mean, it's it's punk music, but the idea is, uh, you know, we're trying to write songs and then deliver it with the energy of the punk music that we grew up on. Cool. So who would you list as some of your kind of influences, just for the fans? Who are you influenced by? What do you sound like, man? Uh, who do we sound like? I would say we sound like 40 Hells, <laughs> but... <laughs> Mostly. Other than that, I mean, we all come from, you know, a massive, uh, you know, just array of different styles. Mainly punk rock music, but, you know, we've all been doing bands for years, you know. Yeah. Joel's a bit older, so he's got, you know, deeper roots in punk rock, whereas, you know, I'm a little younger, Neil's a little younger, <laughs> you know. So we all come from a punk rock background, still, definitely, but, you know. Still the baby of the band at 30. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he is the baby. Not we we you know, we we've had like so many people say different things about what we sound like and where they think we're coming from, but you know yeah. I think for us personally we're just coming from where we're coming from. You know, we don't we don't put emphasis on um, you know something that drew me to this band actually when I uh, first started of them um, over Craigslist. The power of Craigslist. <coughs> Do the power of Craigslist. Craigslist. Yes. But um these guys seem to have their feet in a lot of different, uh, not not you know, widely diverse genres, but you know within the uh, the punk rock umbrella. They had uh, they're over here and they're over here and they're over here and I you know that's exactly what I was looking for when I joined the band. And uh, so it's you know we've we've seems like we've done a pretty good job of keeping ourselves out of the pigeonhole for the most part. Yeah, a lot, a lot of people that I've talked to about the group have a hard time pigeonholing a band, to use the word that Neil used. And I think that that's because we've been playing as long as we have, and the influences are so diverse. 
you know, we're, like I said, we're trying to focus on a song and then just deliver it hard and fast, you know. With, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's yeah. We've we've been through. I guess I guess it it, it boils down to we've been through many decades of styles of music. You know, all the different genres that happened that were huge, and then you know. So we're just, I, I feel that this band is sort of like a conglomerate of all of that, you know, where we're coming from, you know, like, that's, that's the only way to say it, you know, I mean, we consider ourselves punk rock, it's, it's, an, it's an attitude more than anything, you know, not a sound, you it's know, so that's kind of where we're coming from, it's just more like a, you know, yeah. you know, I, I don't know how else to describe it, you know, that's just what we're up to. I mean, I, I, honestly, there's very few words that you could use to describe Yale's music, I mean, it's, it's very, very unique. And honestly, it almost sounds like just three guys up there with a punk rock kind of influence just playing. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's what I think is, is, is powering you guys so much is that you're just up there doing what you love to do. That's where we're coming from. We're definitely not trying to portray any particular sound. Whatever happens when we write music is what happens, you know. If we like it, we're just going to do it, you know. Like, plain and simple. We're not trying to, you know, produce any specific thing for anybody. It's just you know, it's just where we're coming from, you know. If it happens, it happens, you know. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not... That's yeah. great. I mean, um, we need to wrap it up probably. Okay, to cool. on YouTube. All right, well, the last <laughs> thing is that 40 yeah. Hells has a four-song, seven-inch record. We sell them for five bucks, and it comes with a free MP3 download, and you can get uh, some cool colored vinyl. That's what's up. So, where, where, can, where can you find vinyl, that? Vinyl, vinyl, uh, vinyl players. It's going to be at some of the local record stores. We haven't dumped it off there yet, but you can get it at all of our shows. Okay, where can people find you on online? Of course, MySpace, Facebook. Okay. Okay, good. Then just search for 40 Hells. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Sir. Great. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you know, it's great talking with you guys. You guys did an amazing set here at the yeah. final. Thank on, you, man. Uh, on West Beach Street in 17th. And, uh, you know, best of luck in the future, and uh, we will talk to you later. Your shout out to the camera. Thanks for being here. All right. <laughs> All right. Peace. Peace, Thanks, man.